We begin at five with new developments on a domestic murder in Providence last year. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kayla Fish. I'm Mike Montecalvo. Today, the man accused of fatally shooting his ex-girlfriend and fleeing the state is sentenced. 12 News reporter Matt Paddock was there in the courtroom and joins us now live in Providence with the details. Matt. Well, Kayla, Mike, Derek Shepard pleading guilty today to second degree murder. A judge sentencing him a life sentence plus 10 years served. I used to call him Pops. We welcomed him to our family. For 10 years, Bernadette Ortiz and the defendant, Derek Shepard, dated before ending the relationship. Derek Shepard, in 2021, the defendant began living with Miss Ortiz at her second floor apartment at 177 Herald Street in Providence. But according to facts of the case presented by the state, tensions would begin to mount between Shepard and Ortiz. That tension coming to a boiling point on the night of February 9th of last year. The defendant began to argue with Miss Ortiz and she eventually told the defendant to leave. The fight grew louder as Shepard's daughter walked into the bedroom. She saw the defendant standing a few feet away, pointing his gun at Miss Ortiz and fired. She heard multiple shots and fled the room. Six shots fired. Shepard fleeing to Georgia, captured just two days later. The Glock and magazine used found with him. It's just life broken and pain that I suffered. The family of Bernadette Ortiz still reeling at the loss of their mother, holding on to one another in the courtroom, fighting back tears. This defendant took our mom. I hope that he gets the maximum under the law, life without parole. As a judge handed down a life sentence plus 10 years served to Derek Shepard.